Right then, so we're going to make a, our very own woodland xylophone. You need to get two fantastic drumsticks. These are mine from earlier. I like them, so I'm going to keep them. And then you need to collect some larger sticks and logs, which is going to make your musical instrument. So let's go and find some logs. They need to be a good size, not too small. And you can do a little check before you pick them up to see what sound they're going to make. Yeah, I like that one. Let's try this one. Oh yes, I'm having that. Something a bit bigger. Yeah, lovely. Roll that one into spot. I think I'm gonna have three more. But you can make it as long as you want, really. Oh yeah, good noise. Oh, just make sure when you're carrying woods around, wood around that you're careful. And if you need help from a grown-up, you can ask them too. Hey! If you're out on a walk, you can always give the trees a little bash, not too hard, to see what noise they make. Can you hear the difference? Let's see what this one sounds like. This tree's been leaning the whole time I've worked here. It's never fallen down there. Another thing you can do to make natural music is to use a blade of grass. You get your nail, and you just put a little nick in it at the top. And you lay it over your thumb. Bring it down. And then blow. Try again. Okay, so what we're going to do now is we're going to make our very own little musical instrument. There's loads of different ones you can make, but I've chosen to make a mini guitar. All you need is a jar lid, some felt tips, a lollipop stick. I'm sure there's a few knocking around at the moment, but any piece of wood. You could even use the sticks absolutely fine and some elastic bands. All you need to do is decorate your lollipop stick to make it look fancy. Okay, and then glue it to the back of your jam jar. Okay, and then you need to get your elastic bands and very quickly ping them over. And there you have it, your own little guitar. <laughs> 